At this time, we will present several awards to the cadets who have achieved academic and professional excellence in the 2012-2013 academic year. For the audience, please hold your applause until the final award is presented. The Ensign David A. Hoffman Award is presented to the cadet who had the highest academic standing during fourth class year. It will be presented by Mrs. Susan Ludwig, Regional Director of Philanthropy. The winners of the Ensign David A. Hoffman Award are third class Melissa M. Keeley. Accepting this award on her behalf is third class Millie Strain. The Coast Guard Academy Alumni Association Undergraduate Award is presented to the cadet who had the highest academic standing from fourth through second class year. It will be presented by Commander James A. Sylvester, United States Coast Guard retired, president of the USCGA Alumni Association. The winner of the Alumni Association Award is first class Eric J. Bonomi. The Officer Spouse Association Academic Achievement Awards are presented to the cadets who had the most improved academic standing from fourth class year to second class year and fourth class year to third class year. These awards will be presented by Mrs. Tristan Horton, President of the United States Coast Guard Spouse Association of Southeastern Connecticut. The winners of these awards are first class Thomas J. Ashley and second class William O. Doyle. Excellence in the discipline of morals and ethics is presented to the cadet who demonstrated both academic excellence in a morals and ethics course and the ability to apply the skills gained in that course to his or her own values and behavior. It will be presented by Mr. Brad Kidwell, President, Chesapeake and Potomac Chapter, USCGA Parents Association. The winner of this award is First Class Judith and Poimons.
The class of 2009 has two writing awards. One is given annually to a cadet who, in his or her fourth class year, demonstrated an appreciation for the importance of revision, and whose efforts to rewrite resulted in effective and powerful writing. These awards will be presented by Dr. Karen Wink, Section Chief, English and Foreign Language Section, Department of Humanities. The winner of the first award is third class Jacqueline S. Kubigo. The second award is the Creative Writing Award. This award is given annually to a cadet who, in his or her fourth class year, has demonstrated a devotion to the craft of creative writing. The, the award recognizes an individual involved in efforts inside and outside the classroom that promote creative writing. The winner of this award is third class Emily C. Quan. The Commandant's Undergraduate Award is presented to the cadet who had the highest academic standing during third class year. It will be presented by Rear Admiral Sandra L. Stowes, Superintendent, USCGA. The winner of the Commandant's Undergraduate Award is Second Class Caitlin K. Beaver. Accepting this award on her behalf is Second Class Darlene Sow. The George C. Alexander and Robert T. Alexander Excellence in Chemistry and Physics Awards are presented to cadets with the highest academic standings in courses in chemistry and physics. These awards will be presented by Rear Admiral Sandra L. Stowes. The winners of this award are as follows. For Chemistry 1, third class Lauren A. Klein. For Chemistry 2, third class Jacqueline S. Kubigo. For Chemistry 2 honors, Third class, Stephanie L. O'Gara. For physical chemistry and analytical methods, second class, Alexander K. Blue. Accepting this award on his behalf is second class, Brenna Cook. For Physics 1, second class Andrew Lusak. <laughs> For Physics 2, second class Soso Margarita. For Organic Chemistry, first class Matthew A. Monahan. For Toxicology, first class Stephanie J. Joseph. For microbiology, first class Melissa J. Turner. Accepting this award on her behalf is first class Kendra Smith. And for marine pollutions, first class Stephanie J. Joseph.
The Commodore Chris G. Layton Award is presented to the Ian Codger member, deemed to have had the highest proficiency in leadership by the Coast Guard Auxiliary. The award will be presented by Mr. David Tyler, Commander of Division 25, United States Coast Guard Auxiliary. The winner of this award is Second Class Trevor Pennyfender. The Proficiency in Navigation Award is presented to the second class cadet deemed most proficient in the art of navigation during their first two years at the Academy. It will be presented by Master Chief Kevin Less, Southeastern Connecticut Chief Petty Officers Association. The winner of the Navigation Award is second class Patrick J. Dreiss. The Rear Admiral Thomas Davies Award is presented to the cadet who demonstrated excellence in navigation planning and execution during their first year at the Academy. It will be presented by Captain Eric Jones, United States Coast Guard, President of the Surface Navy Association, and Assistant Superintendent. The winner of the Davies Award is Third Class Tara E. Barkin. Accepting this award on her behalf is Third Class Millie Shrink. <coughs> the Society of the Cincinnati Award is presented to the cadet who had the highest cumulative military precedence list average at the end of second class year. It will be presented by Mr. Jackson Dino, <laughs> Jr., Society of Cincinnati of the State of Connecticut. The winner of this award is first class Cassandra and Holly. <laughs> the Military Order of the Loyal Legion of the U.S. Award is presented to the cadet <laughs> who had the highest cumulative military precedence list average at the end of fourth class year. It will be presented by Mr. Peter Stevens, companion, commander of the Military Order of the Loyal Legion of the U.S. The winner of this award is Third Class Tara E. Martin. Accepting this award on her behalf is Third Class Millie Shrain. The Coast Guard Combat Veterans Awards, presented to the male and female cadets who excel in the obstacle course and entry physical fitness exam during their swap summer. It will be presented by Chief <laughs> Officer Ed Bagley, United States Coast Guard, retired, on behalf of the Coast Guard Combat Veterans Association. The winners of this award are 4th Class Madison L. Billing and 4th Class Robert W. May.
The cadet Jonathan K. Brees Outstanding Summer Cadet Leadership Awards are presented to the four summer cadre members who were voted by their peers as the most inspirational leaders during the summer indoctrination program. This award will be presented by Ms. Susan Ludwig, Regional Director of Philanthropy, Coast Guard Foundation. The winners of this award are for Swab Summer Phase 1, Second Class Carolyn Slife. Accepting this award on her behalf is Second Class Cody Kikoa. For Swap Summer Phase 2, Second Class Mark Howard. For AIM Cadre, Second Class Dan Teddy. For Eagle Cadre, Second Class Brenna Cook. Congratulations to all the winners.